hey my lovelies welcome back to my channel this is alice's kitchen so in today's video guys i will be making this amazing sweet chili jerk salmon rasta pasta i do hope you guys enjoy this video now let's cook So guys, here I'm adding salt to 4 cups of water and I'm just going to let that boil. Now once that starts to boil, I'm adding 3 cups of rigatoni pasta and I'm going to cook this according to the package instructions, which is 9 to 10 minutes or until it's al dente. Now you want to go ahead and stir your pasta just to prevent it from sticking together. Now here I have my beautiful salmon and I'm going to slice it thinly, not all the way through though but you can just see what i'm doing <laughs> now you don't have to slice your salmon like what you see me doing here you can go ahead and cook your salmon whole if it's if you're just cooking for yourself or it's you know you're cooking for someone else you can just cut that in two and just bake it as it is So guys, now I'm just adding a cork full of oil just so that the season can stick to the salmon. Now I'm using the Walker's Wood Jerk Season and this is in mild. Now I'm going in between each slices just making sure that it is well seasoned. Next, I'm going in with onion powder, garlic powder, paprika, and I'll also be using some sweet chili sauce. And guys, when I tell you these combo, they were just bomb. Like, they were the bomb. Trust, guys. Just follow this recipe and I promise you, you will not go wrong with this recipe. And the thing is, all these seasons, they just work well together they just complement each other especially the sweet chili sauce on the jerk season guys this was just it was truly amazing like y'all this was bomb fire sick okay this was insanely amazing i mean look at that look how well seasoned each slices are like look at that look at that so good so so good so now for the other piece or half of the salmon i'm just cutting these in cubes you know just making sure that nothing goes to waste i'm just gonna add this to my pasta and i'm gonna season it with jerk season and the sweet chili sauce now i'll be baking this for 10 minutes no longer guys because this is salmon okay because we want our salmon juicy not dry okay so okay guys moving on we're moving on to our peppers and i'm using you know the rasta colors guys green red and yellow i'll also be going in with some onion red onions So on medium to high heat, I'm just adding canola oil to the saucepan and I'm going to let that heat then I'll be adding my veggies. I'm going to saute these veggies for about a minute.
now guys i will be adding garlic powder and onion powder i didn't have any garlic so i'm just going in with the garlic powder and the onion powder i mean you can never go wrong with onions <laughs> so yeah just mix all those together and this it, it it just smells like heaven in the kitchen guys just heaven on earth like it was just everything so good so good now guys i'm going in with half and half you guys can use double cream or even heavy whipping cream if you guys have now i'm just gonna bring this to a boil then i will be adding my cheese So now guys, I'm going in with half tablespoon of that Walker's wood jerk season. I mean, it wouldn't be jerk pasta if we didn't add that jerk season to it, right? Now guys, I'm going in with mozzarella. Oh my goodness, I wish I had actually used pepper jack or monterey jack. I mean, if you guys aren't a fan of pepper or spicy, you know, food, you guys can go ahead and use these types of cheese, but I wish I had go, go ahead and use pepper jack. Oh my goodness, this would have been so bomb. Oh my goodness. But regardless, this was amazing anyways. Like, this was so good. Amazing. But look how creamy this sauce is, guys. This was sick. Now here you see I'm using the rest of that half and half, guys. Nothing goes to waste around here, okay? Now I will be using Parmesan cheese. And this is what's going to give it that little saltiness that it's missing. Now I'm just mixing this out until all the cheese have been melted. Now here you see me adding those little pieces of salmon that you saw me cutting. Yeah, so you just want to add that to your cream sauce. Now I'm adding my pasta and I absolutely love this type of pasta. I think it's the second time I'm using this pasta and I absolutely love it. So guys, here you can see that the sauce is a bit curdled or it looked like it's curdled. It's not curdled, it's just that the cheese, it hadn't been fully melted and that's why it looked like that. But later on in the video, you'll see where it became super creamy and yeah, I was just, you know, being too fast, honey. Like, I just wanted this to be over with so I can just dive in. Okay, I was just being greedy. Do not be like me. <laughs> So now I'm adding more sweet chili sauce and also jerk season because it just looks a bit too white for a sweet chili jerk salmon pasta. I mean, yeah, we need it to look like the name, honey, okay? Like, yeah, now it's becoming. Look at that. Perfection. Now, guys, you see how creamy this is? Oh, my goodness guys this was so good it was so delicious i beg you guys to try this recipe this was amazing it tasted so good like you guys really have to try this recipe though it's so bomb so guys i'm just gently laying this salmon on this bed of pasta and oh my goodness Whew. anyways i'm just going to add some parmesan cheese over that i'll also be using green onion as a pop of color i didn't have any parsley so i'm just going in with green onions and yeah now guys this is a final product i do hope you guys enjoy this recipe guys please hit that subscribe button because i have amazing videos coming out guys i love you guys so 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 much for stopping by and i love you guys so much for watching